Hi, I'm Christopher Dunnigan. This is HandmadeInVermont.com, and today we're talking about the Hubberton Forge Brindle Ring Lamp. This is very cool. To me, it's basically a piece of sculpture long before it's a lamp, but it is a lamp because it does throw light, and it's a Hubberton Forge lamp at that. It's a 272114. Let's get into a lot of the details about it. If you guys are familiar with the Brindle, the whole idea of the Brindle is you're going to have these sticks that are all hand hammered um, in a trip hammer at Hubberton Forge, and then these are all welded together to make this beautiful ring, which is pretty impressive. It's pretty big, too. It's 36.6 .6 inches by 36.6 .6 inches. The depth on it is basically going to be pretty close to um, just a little beyond the, the, the base here. It's 11.6 inches, and that's going to be your depth. It's a beautiful, beautiful fixture. Anyway, I want to get into a couple other things. 28 pounds. Sometimes you guys want to know those kind of things. The base on this is going to be 12 inches. It's an oval, 12 inches by 8.5. Another little detail. And that's where your dimmer is. We'll talk about the dimmer in just a second. The glass on this is going to be brand new for Hubberton Forge. It's not on, on any other fixtures. It's basically a mottled white, kind of a tortoise pattern uh, mottled glass, white glass. And it's very, very pretty on its own. All hand blown. You know, I've never seen it, you know, and I collect glass myself. I have a pretty impressive collection. I've never seen glass like this before, so it's pretty cool. Let's get into what you can use inside of this. There's going to be two G9 sockets, and we know that G9 sockets use G9 bulbs. You're going to be using two 5-watt G9s, and that's going to be pretty bright. And these bulbs come in different ways, and you've got a couple here. So you've got the cob ones that look like corn cobs. The ones that have the yellow strips going through them, those are called phosphorus ones. And like I said, you've got two of the 5 watt, quite a bit of light. And um, it's a dimmable fixture as well. So we'll dim it now with that little knob down there. Oh, dimmed it down. And I don't necessarily think these are dimmable. But um, anyway, you are going to want to get dimmable ones. And where we, we generally get them is Amazon. Amazon's a good place to get um, G9 bulbs. And um, just put in G9 LED bulb and up pops a whole bunch of stuff. You want to zero in on the 5 watt versions of those and they're going to be offered to you in lots of different ways. They're going to be offered to you in 2700 Kelvin so you can make this light kind of yellow like a setting sun. You can make this much whiter too and, and that blue white light that's called daylight which sounds like it should be a warm light but it's not a warm light that's going to be 4000, 5000 Kelvin. You'll see that offered there too. You can get, also get these bulbs at your hardware store. However, to me it's just easier to do it from my, from my computer because we buy so many of them. Plus, I kind of know what I want already, so it's easy just to zoom in there. In the middle of all that, what we do buy for our showroom, and what's in here right now, these are 3,000 Kelvin. That's called warm white or soft white, and that's what I kind of like to use in our showroom. That's the light that's coming down on us from the LEDs in these uh, lights above us, and that's that nice warm light that mimics an incandescent light bulb. Uh, the other thing is, as far as finishes go, you know, since these are going to be too kind of on the whiter side as far as the glass goes, um, I, I like a slightly uh, more contrasting finish. So I think this would be very cool in something like vintage platinum or sterling. This is soft gold, and I think this is just enough of a, um, of a contrast for me. Let's get into metal finishes now. If you are on the handmadeinvermont.com website, look over in the red tabs with the pictures in them over there. You're going to see a finishes help guide tab. Open that up for me. It's going to be a video there of me talking to you guys about the differences in Hubbardson Forge finishes, how they can look on different types of forging. I'm going to be referencing a chart just down below. So scroll down a little bit. You're going to see a chart. You can click on that chart. So you can click on dark smoke. You can click on soft gold. Doesn't matter. Big page will pop up showing lots of different things in that finish. You can go back to the chart and you'll notice there's letters A's on them, letter B's on some of those things, and that's going to be showing you this range of variants that you can expect to see on different translucent finishes, but I'll talk about all of that in the video, okay? Okay, showroom. Our showroom in Vermont has over 400 Hubberton Forge fixtures. This is the biggest showroom in the world at Hubberton Forge. No other showroom is like this. Hubberton Forge doesn't even have their own showroom. They use this one. Uh, what's on display? We have a great tab on that. On, in those same red tabs, you're going to see a what's on display page. So open that up. It's going to show you everything we have on display and including which finish, which shade, all of those things and what kind of glass is on there. We're open every day except Sunday, 11 to 6. 
I'm here every day except Sunday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Eastern Time. We also have an amazing clearance center. Clearance center stuff is 75% off MSRP. It's returns, discontinued stuff, showroom samples. You have to come here to use it. Can't call us or email us about it, but it's definitely worth coming in to look at if you're in Vermont. Plus, you want to use the showroom anyway because there's just so much great stuff here to see. Our number in Vermont, 802-446-2400. You can email us seven days a week, 24 hours a day. Love to answer emails, and it's sales at handmadeinvermont.com. So when you order from handmadeinvermont.com, shipping is going to be free to every state except Alaska and Hawaii. No tax if we ship out of the state of Vermont. And we're the only dealer with 90-day returns, no restocking fee. Nobody else does that. Some larger items are going to be non-returnable. It's going to be really important that you are looking at the fixture on that page and kind of scroll down under, under the description. It'll tell you if that is the case. And that's usually for really big, giant, huge fixtures, mostly that go out on pallets. Okay, that's it. Rush program. Let's talk about that. So rush program. Hubbardton Forge generally takes about three to four weeks to go out the door. That's production time before your transit time. You always have to add that on, too. We offer a rush program that takes you from that three to four weeks down to a little under two weeks, it's it's a very small addition per line item. So if you have like one, two, three items, like let's say three or four outdoor sconces, and they're all the same size, and they're all the same finish, that's one line item. So it's very inexpensive to rush those kind of things. Don't be afraid to email us and ask about that. Okay, so that's really it. If you guys have any other questions, let us know. We would love to see you in our showroom sometime. And thanks for stopping in.